Thank you to my Patreon supporters. A double shout out thank you to Xavier Zamora, Victor Vegas, Velimir Brockovich, Troy Smothers, and Safe Moon Oz for being higher level patrons. You can join that for as little as $1 a month. There is a link down in the description below. Also, thank you to my YouTube members. If you'd like to show your support there, simply click the join button below this video. Please keep in mind that I am not a financial advisor. Everything I'm sharing is my own opinion. It's my own research. I highly encourage you to go do your own research. And with that being said, let's go ahead and dive on into this. We are gonna be talking about alpha nodes. There is another Medium article that has been published. If you have missed my previous video coverages on alpha nodes, you can check them out on my channel. I am very fascinated by what it is that they're building and I'm excited about finding out what they're doing next. So this Medium article, we're seeing each one being launched about 48 to 72 hours apart. They did notify us in advance that they have, I think it was five or six Medium articles that are gonna be released here in the next couple weeks. So this one just premiered. Let's go ahead and talk about what this one's about. What it means to be an alpha. Status update. Our last two Medium articles have really shaken up the DeFi space and threw in a number of fun twists to alpha nodes and how our project will move forward. Before we get into the meat of things, let's give a quick recap of our new re, of our new found roadmap and where we are at currently. Phase one, reflection token. That's where we're at right now. Phase two, nodes as a service plus the NFT marketplace. Phase three is multi-chain launch and phase four, yet to be disclosed. Oh, you got something else in the works, huh? Now to give you some insight on what has to be done to get from phase one to phase two, it says that they need to hire engineers and software devs, build out architecture for a completely custom platform, i.e. custom contracts for both the NFT marketplace and NAAS, server space, design work, website dev, etc. Hire a proficient NFT artist to create top tier art for our NFT slash node collection. Network with other projects to vet our first listed partners. That just skims the surface. We have come so far from being just the reflection token we were at launch. And all of these plans will, will soon be updated into a fully descriptive roadmap on our website that will show our progress and update our holders on what exactly is being worked on. We're all about transparency here. Perfecting AVAX Phase 2. One of the main focuses of this article is to address the multi-chain launch we teased in our first Medium article back on February 21st. This multi-chain launch will include all of the new elements of our Phase 2 and will come once we've perfected things on the AVAX chain and are ready to launch a new collection on the new chain as well as open up our multi-chain functionality to our NFT marketplace. Limited Collection. In our last Medium article, we brought up current issues other node projects face and why these issues occur. One of those issues was runaway node creation, meaning at one point more nodes will be created than the rewards pool can sustain. This has been seen in nearly every node project and is something we will avoid. How will this be avoided? Our NFT's nodes will be limited to a collection of 10,000. That's it. This means that once 10,000 nodes slash NFTs are minted, the ability to create a new node will be unavailable. The same as when an NFT collection gets fully minted out, it's almost like it's an NFT collection. Oh wait, it is. When you mint your node, it will also mint an alpha wolf NFT that is tied to your node. Your alpha wolf will have varied rarities and can be treated as collector's pieces or maybe a profile pick if you happen to snag a rare one. These will act as traditional NFT collections on top of the utility of being a node and have the potential to fetch higher prices for more rare attributes. Shareholder in our ecosystem. These NFTs are in essence preferred stock in the Alpha Lab company. What we are building doesn't end with the NFT collection, nodes, reflection mechanics, any of this. The vision our founders have for Alpha is to be a private launchpad to enable our engineers and architects to build full blockchain applications that require large initial investments to do right. The NFT marketplace will be massive, but just a start. Rather than paying back these returns to venture capitalist firms or private investors, you, the Alpha holder, get to benefit directly from the massive ecosystem we are building. Genesis Alpha Wolf NFTs. 
In our first ever Medium article, we had our first mention of NFTs and how these will help us bootstrap our launch onto the next chain, among other development. This is still happening, and here is a full breakdown of how it will go. We will launch 157 Genesis Alpha Wolf NFTs that embody the best traits, rarities, and emit the highest rewards or APR. These will be very exclusive, expensive, and in return will be very profitable to the holders. These are seen as the seed funding necessary for us to move to our next step on multi-chain and therefore the holders of these will be treated as elite shareholders with extra special perks and rewards. Below is a breakdown of the different tiers of these Genesis NFTs. 100 Alphas, the most elite leaders and VIPs of the Alpha Pack, 47 Ronin, Alpha Pack's most dangerous and efficient protectors slash warriors, 10 Apex Predators, the top of the top, nothing is better than the Apex. These will be auctioned off, all with a starting auction price that is yet to be disclosed. The APRs will also be disclosed in a future Medium article, most likely our next. Who is eligible for a Genesis Alpha Wolf? Only holders of more than 2 trillion Alpha tokens will be eligible to bid in this exclusive NFT mint. The mint will take place roughly 5-7 to seven days prior to our Phase 2 launch, and each new holder will be able to flaunt their extra special NFT for a few days prior to the public mint. We may do an upcoming raffle event to win an eligibility spot in this mint. And then it says right here, Alpha Nodes, Genesis NFTs, 100 Alpha, 47 Ronin, 10 Apex Predator. And then OG Recap and Multi-Chain. So where does the OG tie into all of this? We have noticed that OG spots have become quite deflationary as early whitelist please. Jeets joined our Discord and then left within the first days, weeks of the project. As our project grows, we have plans to open up very exclusive bounties to earn these OG spots. Our OG spots are meant for long-term convicted holders that we find worthy of completely free airdrops on our next chains. Our OG holders will be rewarded with a free AVAX node upon the launch of our Phase 2, and will also have exclusive benefits when we launch on the next chain. These OG spots are basically whitelist opportunities for our future projects and chain launches. What else is in store? Everything we are doing is unique and aims to solve an issue. We will not fork, we will be forked. That is our motto. We have already seen other projects pop up copying our model of launching as a reflection and growing a treasury to bootstrap into phase two. As you can probably tell from our track record and future plans, we want the same things you do as a holder. Us developers are simply investors like yourself with the vision of building a project that does what we all want. Innovative solutions through hard work, honesty, and conviction, and navigate through the crazy depths of DeFi until we find a sustainable solution for passive income without Ponzinomics. We'll be the first to admit that much of DeFi contains elements of Ponzinomics, but we want to be the first DeFi application 100% free of Ponzinomics and create a solid and honest corner. That is our goal, and we have achieved so much already in such a little time to kickstart our journey. Thank you for coming along. What's next? They say that their next Medium article will be discussing what you've all been waiting for, the price to create a node, our tokenomics, how emissions will work, and more. We have been working very, very hard behind the scenes, so thank you for your patience. These coming articles will have more visual sneak peeks on the design and progress of our work on Phase 2. P.S. Our Alpha Fund Treasury now has a total value of nearly $218,827 with $166,826.96 being liquid cash. Here are our current investments. $101,617 in stablecoin farming at 12% APR on Pangolin. $10,300 in DAI.E ready to be deployed. You have $54,909.96 in DAI.E and our Gnosis multi-sig safe wallet recently invested a total of $52,000 in two other node projects, paying out roughly $1,200 per day or an 842.31% APR. Treasury has been steadily growing by roughly $10,000 per day. I think that's actually incredible milestone achievements for as little time that Alpha Nodes has been out as well as everything that's so chaotic going on in the markets right now, especially with the war and all of that, right? So good job on being able to achieve this with all of that being in consideration. 
and um, absolutely incredible to find out about these specific nfts the 100 alpha 47 ronin 10 apex predators remember guys you got to have at least two trillion of the alpha node tokens the price fluctuates all the time but you know you can go in place put in your value there and find out how much that's going to cost you but you should expect it to be in the thousands of dollars right i don't know as far as when you're watching this video if markets have hit even harder and crazier for everything but yeah Anyways, thank you guys all so much for tuning in. Let me know what your thoughts are about this specific update and if you're excited about the next one where they go more into the, the details about how much it's going to cost for the nodes. Uh, I am very curious and I'm looking forward to that for sure. So let us know in the comments down below. I do have referral links in the description if you want to get free crypto, free stock. If you want to be able to protect your crypto, you can look into getting a, stole, uh, a cold storage wallet like the Elipal. I have a code in there to give you a discount. And if you're new to the channel, do not forget to hit subscribe, hit the thumbs up like button. It definitely helps us out with the YouTube search algorithm. Click the bell icon so you know whenever we go live. God bless, and I will see you in the next episode.